Welcome to the Layer 2 Taxonomy Manager product video. My name is Lars Filinski and I'm working as a sales consultant for Layer 2. As a Microsoft Gold certified partner and ISV based in Hamburg, Layer 2 is one of the leading providers of Microsoft SharePoint and Office 365 apps in Europe with a major focus on data integration, collaborative knowledge management and social networking. Layer 2 is also known as a reliable partner to customers in Central Europe, offering additional consulting services in the fields of SharePoint, .NET programming and IT infrastructure for more than 20 years. The Layer 2 Taxonomy Manager for Microsoft SharePoint 2010 and 2013 is a standalone product within the Layer 2 Knowledge Management suite. It provides an easy way to import and export taxonomies, save them and exchange them between different systems. Key features are an export, import and update feature for term sets. Support for the use of ASCOS format for free and commercially available taxonomies. The ability to make major upgrades of a present taxonomy without losing already classified content. A taxonomy deployment, for example, for transmitting a taxonomy from the test system to the production system. And an additional term management of attributes such as rules for content classification with a layer 2 tag suggester and out tagger. In this demo, I will show you how to import and export term sets with the Layer 2 Taxonomy Manager in the Term Store, as well as updating them. If you have, for example, purchased a taxonomy in ASCOS format, you can import it in the Term Store of your SharePoint using the Layer 2 Taxonomy Manager. By default, SharePoint provides only a simple CSV import function that supports neither synonyms nor multilingualism. In this example, we have a taxonomy with the title Marketing and Sales as ASCOS file, which we now want to import as a term set in the Term Store group Showcase. ASCOS stands for Simple Knowledge Organization System, a widely used standard for the exchange of knowledge. All presented terms in the ASCOS file are stored in both German and English language. Furthermore, some terms have alternative expressions, so-called synonyms. To import this file, we navigate to the Term Store. Then we select the term group Showcase in the left tree view. The Taxonomy Manager provides us with a button Import Term Set and the General Properties. By clicking on this button, an import dialog opens up and we can choose our ASCOS file Marketing and Sales. After clicking Import, the import process starts and you will be informed about the progress of the import process. If you get the notification that the imported file has the wrong format, please check whether it is in valid ASCOS format for the file to be imported. After the import is completed, you can close the dialog box. The term set, Marketing and Sales, is now available in the group showcase. If we are now expanding the term Sales and select Education and Training, the scrolled synonyms are displayed for this term on the property page. The synonyms given in the ASCOS file were also imported by the Taxonomy Manager and are now available for use in SharePoint. We now change the language of our term store from English to German. We get the German terms of our term sets, marketing and sales. That means that also the translation of the German terms were imported from the Taxonomy Manager. Beside the importing function that we've just seen, the Layer 2 Taxonomy Manager also provides an export function for term sets. Thus, you have the option to transfer your managed metadata from a test system to a production system, create a backup of them, or make major updates to a term set. SharePoint provides no export function out of the box in the term store. To start an export of a term set with a taxonomy manager, simply select the corresponding term set, in this case marketing and sales, and then click on the button export term set. This opens the export dialog. Click Export to start the process. Once the export is completed, close the window. The term set Marketing and Sales was exported with all the information into a ASCOS file. This file can now be imported into another system, for example. But changes of the exported file can also be made to subsequently update the file and the term set. Already classified content is not lost. To update a term set after it has been exported and processed, Select the term set and click on Update Term Set in the General Properties. This opens the Update dialog. Select the edited ASCOS file and set the appropriate update options. There are three options available. First, Create New Terms. Terms that were added to the file will be created. 
Secondly, update existing terms. Terms that have been changed in the file will be updated. And at last, delete missing terms. Terms that have been deleted in the file are removed. Then click the update button to start the process. After successfully updating it, the dialog can be closed. Furthermore, rules for an automatic classification of SharePoint content with metadata in the Term Store can be set up with the Taxonomy Manager. This function will be discussed in one of the next videos. The Layer 2 Taxonomy Manager can be downloaded after registration at the Layer 2 homepage. It can be used for free with some shareware limitations. To have the full functionality, you have to purchase a license. Thank you for joining. Please visit www.layer2.de slash en slash products for more information.